The past must be dead. We cannot go on. Can we just forget everything? Then it is dead. Sorry. I may have some latent anger at times. Understood. There is nothing but now. Maybe that is the way through for us. There's nothing but now. There was no past. There was no future. Right now, looking at you, touching your hand, I'm happy. Me too. Jealous tonight, I think. You or me? I suspect, honestly, both. Mm, powerful love, powerful pain at seeing another prick one's interest. A woman who has loathed you, tried to kill you, overthrown you, and imprisoned you, walks into a room and tells you she loves you. What do you do? First, try and start breathing again. And then? You aim to rile me. I like it. Our love is fierce, it is a sun, it burns within us, and sometimes it feels it will consume us. But it never does. And who's got all the powers? The one who made a mistake and knows he will never stop paying, but is happy to pay. Or the one who is wronged, as a stick to always beat the other one with. Make me forget. As you grow larger and larger, as we both know you will, I will look smaller and smaller to him and to you. I see your son's eyes, the way they brighten when they're on you. You are my great love. And you mine? You are a wonder to me. And you me? And us? We have rewritten each other in the best, most infuriating way. That is enough. I love you. My whole fucking heart and all my body and whatever ineffable spirit animates me. Everything. Russia, the only way out of marriage is death. Ooh, noted with interest. Hmm. Funny. I think you're both exceptional people, and that makes it hard. You live life at its edges, and this is why we're perfect together. The edge of anything is sharp, so you rule each other merely because you are you. So. You need to find a way to accept that there will be wounds, or that at points, you will need to step back from yourselves for the sake of the other. I'd love to not love you some days, Jane. She's a burden, is it? Unrequited love is notoriously so. My patience is wearing the Love you. I used to say, when a woman wants to kill you, you're in business. I will cut your fucking throat. Aim for the belly. Fucking believe you, I'm about to cut your throat and you're making jokes. Perhaps that is why you love me. Nothing really matters now. But I can pretend it does. But it doesn't. Huzzah. Huzzah.